So when you're planning for accessibility, it's really, really tempting to think of it as codes or laws or minimum、uh, standards. But the problem is that when you think that way, you're thinking about the bare minimum, and you're not really thinking about who you're building your accessibility for. So when you look at your building, look at who it's for. Look at anything that you can do to make sure those people, those intended users, can actually use. Your building. So, for example, if you are building a senior center,、um, you might want to build more than the minimum number of accessible parking spots. You might want to build wider parking spots because many seniors might use,、uh, you know, electric scooters or power wheelchairs, and if they drive, they're going to have ramps that will swing outwards, and they're going to need that space to deploy the ramp. So this is why you want to go beyond any minimum requirements to make sure that they can actually use your space.